the Amazon rainforest is home to thousands of indigenous communities spread across very remote areas. Their only means of transportation is by riverboat. It can take many hours and even days to reach the next village. When local doctors run out of medicines, new supplies have to be shipped by boat. So, for example, if a villager is bitten by a snake and a doctor is out of antivenom, the villager may not live to see the medicine when it finally arrives. Snake bites are a major concern in the Amazon. Doctors report an average of 45 snake bites per month in the Contamana region alone. We Robotics was invited by the Peruvian Ministry of Health and local doctors to explore whether drones could support medical delivery efforts in the rainforest. We Robotics Peru Flying Labs took the lead in the field testing and were highly successful. Actually, we were able to transport medicine, the antivenom and medicine from the Contamana city to Pampermosa city. The cold pack with the antivenom was placed into the drone and then hand launched. It took the drone 35 minutes to reach the village of Pampa Hermosa, about 40 kilometers away. A regular boat would have required six hours to reach the village. In Pampa Hermosa, villagers witnessed the first ever drone delivery in their village. The local doctors asked a boy to simulate a snake bite so they could demonstrate the importance of drone deliveries. That night, the drone flew back to Contamana. We flew his blood sample on a special refrigerated vessel, and then we flew back to um, Contamana, and then we were able to get that one. We go to the main square, and we show to the whole population about the importance of using these UAVs for humanitarian reasons. The first ever cargo drone deliveries in the Amazon rainforest were a success. As a result, the Ministry of Health and local doctors have invited We Robotics to carry out additional deliveries to even more remote villages. <laughs>